Hi guys, it's Kieran, another Indian doctor, and welcome back to the channel. A few weeks ago, I had a Spanish company reach out to me and they said, would you like to try out our wireless stethoscope? To which I said, of course. So it arrived in the post recently and I've not opened it yet. So today we're gonna be unboxing the eCure wireless Bluetooth stethoscope. So in principle, this thing could be really, really cool. Disclaimer, they sent it to me for free. And in today's video, I'm gonna be unboxing this and talking about some of the features. And then I'm gonna try it out for a few weeks and I'll make another video to let you guys know what it's like using a wireless stethoscope as a doctor. Is it practical? Is it better? Does it work better than my regular stethoscope? So this is just the unboxing. So if you're here to watch me use the stethoscope, this is not that video. But if you wanna check it out and see what it looks like, then stick around. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can get updates about future videos. It's come from Spain, Burgessot, Calle Valencia. And now we're gonna open it up. We've got this one box here with the EQRA logo on it, which will open up in a second. And then we've got a second box. I had a virtual meeting with one of the guys from the company recently and he talked me through how to use it. So at least I've got a bit of an idea of the features before I try it out this week. This part is the Bluetooth receiver. And then this box has got their logo on it. These are the two packages that have come for it. From what I understand, the reason they've sent a Bluetooth receiver as well is that this can be used over the wireless network, a higher quality, or it can be used over Bluetooth. Step one is trying to open the box. I feel like this video should be called Doctor Tries to Open Box. And this is what it looks like. Inside of the box, we've got what looks like the head of a stethoscope. So this actually looks like the head of any old stethoscope, but it's got a small screw cap at the end of it, which presumably will screw onto the uh, device itself. We've got a uh, instruction manual, which hopefully is in English as well. Yeah, they've got an English part of it as well. So instruction manual, head of the stethoscope, actual stethoscope itself. There's a few different lights on the stethoscope. There's a light that has a little battery symbol on it. There's a light that has a heart and a lung symbol and a light that has a Wi-Fi symbol. So the battery one obviously is the battery. The heart and the lung one, the chap from the company who explained it to me, basically said that you can isolate these noises. So you can listen to it like a normal stethoscope or you can listen to just higher pitched frequencies and so you're just listening to heart sounds. So you'll listen to a patient's chest and you'll just hear the heart sounds or you can change that down and you can just listen to the lung sounds. I think that's really interesting and that would be a really cool application if you're able to do that, especially because some people have really loud heart sounds that may overpower other noises. There's also a power button, there's an up and down button where you can change the volume of the stethoscope, a little bar chart symbol thing, I'm not sure what that's called. Oh, it's turned on, it's turned on. Ooh, let's screw this one to here then. That's it. So I've literally just screwed it on. Also in the box is a pair of headphones. You can use it just like an electronic stethoscope as well, so it doesn't have to be wireless. So it's just a regular headphone jack in the bottom of this. So I could plug these headphones into there and listen to it like a regular electronic stethoscope. There is a charging cable and micro USB charger. This looks like a similar charger you get with Android phones. That's literally it in the box. And in the second box, we have got a wireless stereo receiver and transmitter, two in one. I've just unboxed pretty much the whole thing off screen. That's how new I am to these things. We've got a little Bluetooth transmitter. We've got what looks like a headphone to a headphone port. So it plugs into the headphone bit of this and that will plug into the headphone bit of there. That is now a Bluetooth stethoscope. That little device could connect to any Bluetooth headphones that you've got. And then I've got another headphone to headphone cable. I'm not sure what that's about, but I'm sure I'll find out. And also another little charger, presumably to charge this little Bluetooth device. So in theory, what I should be able to do is use this plugged in to this and connect that to my AirPods and be able to listen to a patient's lungs like that. The other thing I should be able to do is use it without this at all 
and actually have this connected to a Wi-Fi network. I can connect this to my phone. You should be able to get better quality sounds and also you should be able to save those recordings. So they've got an app where you should be able to save those recordings, send it to someone else, have those analysed, whatever you need to do with them. It's a really interesting concept. I can't wait to try it out. Hopefully if it works, it sounds like it could be really good. Obviously, thank you to eCure for sending me this stethoscope. I'm gonna try out the stethoscope, give you my honest opinions and compare it to my normal stethoscope. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing, guys. It's kind of like watching me at Christmas opening a new stethoscope. If you've got any specific questions about it that you want me to answer, drop me a message on Instagram at another Indian doctor or drop a comment on YouTube and we can sort something out. As always guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can see the full review when it finally comes out. Take care guys and I'll see you soon.